Beautiful people, today is a very special day. For us, for Lucky Liu, we are crossing with a ferry from Puerto Montt to Chaiten, Carretera Austral. We are living here this hill above the, the city where we just slept uh, for one night, uh, so we are ready to, to go to the port. Yes, we have the ferry at 11 pm, but we should be there two hours before at 9 pm. We will explain you everything in the track because we I think we need to wait I just want to show you okay Lucky Liu is here and from here we have the view of the Mirador of Puerto Monte we can see the place where we will start our ferry crossing tonight I'll see if I can show you okay I think that thing it's a uh where the captain of the boat will be. We will be leaving uh, here and going uh, south that way. Sara? Yes. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm just closing my, my shoes. What Can I show mean? them uh, just these birds? Uh? They're super cute. Okay, anyways, back to the storytelling. Back to the storytelling. Today was full full of activities because we want to be 100% ready to go on the Carretera Austral. We spend the whole day in Puerto Montt doing a lot of stuff. We have to withdraw some money, fill up our fuel tanks and do some groceries. Let's go! Scotia Bank is one of the banks here in Chile where you can withdraw without the fee. We draw the money in Chile is better than Argentina because the amount of money that you can withdraw is higher. In Argentina you can just withdraw 50, maximum 80 dollars and you pay 10 dollar fee. So it's not, it's not okay inside, it's really bad. As you saw, all the glasses are destroyed and the bank is completely destroyed from the outside it's not possible to withdraw in dollars here so we are okay with chilean pesos in all puerto Montt, you cannot withdraw in uh, us dollars us yes it's not possible we should be good with this yeah let's go Doing grocery on the Carretera Austral could be really expensive so we are trying to do everything here but we don't fit in the parking lot usually the parking lots here are a garage the maximum height is uh, 2 meters and 40 right? yeah they are uh, too small and we saw other um, supermarkets uh, but uh, we saw on Iverlander that uh, there were organized robbers that uh, even if you leave your car there or your uh, overlanding vehicle, you know, it can be a van, a truck camper or any kind of RV, yes. uh, they will come and they break your window, they will break your, um, your doors. Uh, so we di didn't want to risk. No, exactly. But you see here, we don't fit. We don't fit. And, uh, you can see here where the trucks are. It's no estacional. Let's go and buy some stuff. This is a big grocery. We spent about 110 US dollars, but we fill up the Hello. all the carts. Now we go back to Lucky Liu to check him to see if everything is okay and then we'll fill up the tank. It's not raining anymore. Yeah, the rain gave us a break, so yeah. we are trying to go there. And we are getting excited for the ferry, guys. It's time to put everything 
Inside the fridge, right Sara? Yeah, our fridge runs on propane and electricity. Usually we run it on propane and it's huge as you can see. What I use to avoid bad smells inside the fridge is a uh, bicarbonato. Go inside the fridge. This is our big fridge. And we have the freezer and guys like just to buy a fridge like this you can spend more than thousand dollars and this is what we pay for the camper actually <laughs> so, just the fridge uh, was yes. worth it all the price of the camper and when we bought lucky Liu, the camper everything was working like the fridge stove oven everything the heater that heater. now is not working everything was just perfect when we know that we are going and we are driving on a carretera on a highway that is like in the middle of nowhere we love to do all the groceries we need and uh, to be sure that if we get stuck or if you need something we can eat and we can drink without any problem so water checked propane checked food check withdrawal from the bank check now we just miss the the fuel i will show you the prices we have gasoline special 881 gasolina super 913 and gasolina premium 945 diesel is 678 you accept credit card yes okay perfect okay where are you 93 93 let's see how much will be the total okay so we have this one for the gas and that one for the propane for the propane Guys, we end uh, our uh, fuel just here, so we had to push uh, Lucky Liu a little bit. Uh. 73 liters, 64,000. 65? Okay, let's do the math together. 65,000, $83.15 for 73 liters of gas. As you can see, it's pretty expensive here in Puerto Montt, in Chile, but on the Carretera Austral will be more expensive, you will see. That's why we decided to fill up here. We have the, the two jerry cans, they are full. We have everything. We have cash, we have food, we have water, we have propane, we have fuel. Now we just need to prepare all our gears for the ferry of tonight. We have the ferry at 11 p.m. but we need to be there at 9. I'm back! Uh, I'm back! <laughs> okay. Okay, so in the meantime it's 3.20 p.m. and we need to eat breakfast, we need to eat lunch. Uh, but we wanted to be sure that we have everything under control and everything is okay. Because this expedition, this ferry is really important. It's the beginning of the Carretera Austral or Southern Highway. Should you go back in that uh, where we slept? Yes, uh, in that we, we will go back there and see you guys later. The fuel is expensive, but blueberries and peaches are just incredible. I love them. I bought, I don't know, probably one pound of uh, blueberries for one dollar. Peaches, one dollar a kilo. We took our tickets with the Naviera Austral. You have no other options if you want to take the ferry from Puerto Montt to Chaiten. We are arriving now at the address Puerto Montt Chaiten. You can see on the sign on the right. Here we go. The ferry is every day. 11 p.m. There are no ferries on Sunday. I think we are not the first. Okay, they are checking the documents right now, so we can probably go in line. Checking our plate. I will ask him if it's possible to sleep inside our camper during the night. Buenas tardes. Hola, buenas tardes, señor. Hola. Si será alguno que se puede dormir dentro de la isla. Sí. He's saying that it's possible to sleep inside Al Hilio. This is a great news, guys. When you purchase the ticket, you need to purchase the ticket also for the seats for the two of us and for Lucky Liu. We're moving. We're moving. Woo! 
Let's get on the ferry, let's go! A lot of people! It's our turn! Ba -da -ba -ba. They are taking measurement of the vehicles. So probably we will fit exactly now. Let's go, let's get let's on go. the boat. Sorry guys, I know it's pretty dark. But it is the way it is. It's uh, 10.26 p.m. Naviera Austral, guys. A lot of people already in the ship. Super excited. Excited? Yeah! yeah! <laughs> this is our fourth ferry, guys. Fourth ferry experience. The first one was in Canada, Bowen Island uh, to Vancouver. The second one was from Baja California, La Paz to Mazatlan, mainland Mexico. The third one uh, was from uh, Panama to Colombia. And this one is the fourth. Okay, okay, okay. Here we are. So we can go down, I think. I will ask him if they yes. can leave us a little okay. bit. Okay. Thank you. Because we asked the permission to sleep in our truck camper, so we don't need to stay and sit really uncomfortable for these 13 hours, something like this. Like the ferry should be nine hours. We should arrive tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. What are they doing, Sara? They are secure our truck camper and with chains and some wood blocks yeah. so we don't move. I think we'll be pretty, pretty tight with all the vehicles coming in. It should be like the one in Mexico. If you haven't seen the video of our ferry crossing from Baja California to Mexico, check up here, guys. There is a beautiful truck camper over there. There is a big motorhome. We have space here to go up there. Okay, as you can see, we are secured. We are checking. We are filling up the boat. Here is where people can take. Yes. Let's have a tour of our ferry. <laughs> <laughs> With the right music. Yeah. Oh, nice thing. Warm here. We have our seats uh, as well, if we want. Let's see if there is like some electricity. We need to plug our computers. Uh, no power, no power. We are here. We are going to Chaiten. Good evening. Good evening. You see the view from here? Yeah. We're leaving. We're moving. Bye bye. Bye bye. Sarah is cooking some dinner, and outside uh, you can see the view. We are moving, we are moving. Hey, I <laughs> saw you. What's that? That's that. It's a fairy dance. The fairy dance. Exactly. For the two people, so Luca and I and the truck camper, Lucky Liu, we paid around 200 US dollars. We tried to book it online but it's not easy especially if you don't book it in advance if you have a vehicle that is bigger than a normal one that is five meters they allow vehicles of five meters to pay less if you are bigger than five meters you need to pay more but it's not possible to do it online so we try to call we try to send emails but nobody answered to us so what we did we went directly to the office Naviera Austral office in Puerto Montt 
we explain the situation I say no we don't have any reservation for you mm, but we, you need to pay more so in the in the end we pay forty dollars more for one meter more because we are six meters so we are one meter longer than normal vehicles what we strongly recommend to you if you want to do the same is to book it in advance if you have the possibility we pay less than the ferry that we pay for Mexico for Baja California Mexico but in Mexico we had the dinner and the breakfast included this time we don't have anything but luckily we can sleep in our truck camper Lucky Liu and I think for Lucky Liu and for us as well this is a really important moment because we are starting the Carretera Austral I feel that in Mexico was super hot uh was crazy and now here is nice and cold just noisy i really recommend you to watch that video because the dolphins uh, they were dancing in front of the ferry it's something we never saw in our lives so it was beautiful what i didn't expect was a ferry during the night i was just so happy to cross during the day so you can see the fjords the island the landscape but this route from puerto Montt to chaiten it's just during the night so every day 11 p.m. not on Sunday so from Monday to Saturday every day you can take this ferry this nine hours ferry if they they will be in time we don't know so let's see how it goes good night beautiful people we we'll see you tomorrow guys it's incredible to think that we are in our home in a truck camper on a ferry <laughs> On the Pacific Ocean, in Patagonia, Chile, Chile, going to Carretera Austral. It's just incredible to think that we had dinner here. We are, we'll try to sleep here. We don't know how much we can sleep. It's super noisy. It's super noisy. I don't know if you can hear, but it's like, and all the camper is vibrating, really strong. Like, we love you, and we'll catch you tomorrow morning. Besitos. Good morning, beautiful people. And just like this, <laughs> it's morning. Wow. Do you want to show outside? Yes, let's go. But first, coffee. It's starting to rain. I wanted to do a drone footage, but uh, it's raining now, so I don't think I will be able to do it. We had our coffee. I have my tea. <laughs> we are almost there. Yeah. You already can see land. Here we are on the back of the the boat. We we tried to sleep. I think we slept three four hours. Yeah. No. Yeah. Corcovado, it's raining. The camera is all getting wet. Okay, it's freezing, freezing. Let's go back into Lucky You. Breakfast in the car. What is inside? Two croissant with uh, for Luca butter and jam, and for me just jam. Ooh, nice and hot. Frambuesa, that is. Uh, Raspberry jam, one of my favorites. I love like all the red fruits, blueberries, strawberries, everything. Time to go, time to go. I have Luca here and I have Luca here. I have Luca here and I have Luca here. <laughs> let's go, let's go. Look this truck camper. It's the one that I tried to show you last night. It's amazing, it's like wow. a spaceship. Beautiful. You're free? Yeah. And we are officially in Chaiten, Carretera Austral. <laughs> Give me five, baby. Can we 
stay here for a week or so Just watch the corn grow in the fields I don't know what's on your mind But I know that it's something about you and me I'll stay here for as long as I can the storms and through the calm When you smile at me I slowly begin to realize that you are the one We made it! We made it! We made it! Once again! Nobody can stop us! Nobody can stop us at Lucky Liu! Thank you, Ferry! Bye-bye! We need to find a place to stop because now we need to organize where to go, what to visit. This part of the world is famous for the hikes, it's famous for the beautiful nature, the stunning views. Our plan is no plan. The town of Chaiten was destroyed in 2009 because we are really close to a volcano and the volcano was inactive for hundreds of years and then suddenly it just erupted, destroyed everything. So they are trying to rebuilding hotels, cabanas, new homes, but it seems like a um, little ghost town. And you can still see the, the effects of the flood, of yeah. the destruction. Nobody died here because everybody was evacuated in time, but a lot of people never came back. This is the view from our window. We are just parked uh, under a. There is this uh, this antenna up there. Don't know if you can. No, you can probably not see it. But there is a Wi-Fi antenna. So we are working here in Lucky Liu. Here you can see how all this area was affected by the flood. And Terrible. Yes, we are in Villa Santa Lucia. Let me show some houses. Here you can see the damage, all this area, all you where the flags are, there were houses. Here it's, it's written que paso aquí. What, what ha happened here? So if you want m more information, you can go to the museum that is right that house here with the green roof. Don't go inside, Sara. It's dangerous. That's what I'm curious. Wow. Wow. I hope nobody died. Okay, we are in Villa Santa Lucia. We arrived with the ferry in Chaiten here and we started our carretera austral going down here, south. We are here. As you can see, you can turn on the left and go to Futaleofu or you can continue south and just go on on the carretera austral this one the 16 uh, december 2017 a flood came through and uh, 21 people lost uh, their lives here yeah it was a huge amount of water coming from the rain it was just two years and a half ago this house uh, survive you can still see here the water. It's too late, too late, too late, too late. Slide down the rooftop. Slide down the rooftop. It's too late, too late, too late, too late. You'd have to rebuild me from the ground up. From the ground.
Solo con el corazón podemos ver bien lo esencial, es invisible a los ojos. Just with the heart we can see truly, we can see good, the essential is invisible to the eyes. A few videos ago we were watching uh, the movie The Little Prince uh, and then we just arrived here and there is the sentence, uh, the quote uh, of yes. the movie on this rock, uh, on this place uh, where everything uh, was, was destroyed. destroyed. Yes, it's incredible to find the same quote that we were mentioning a few videos ago. I think it's just fate, it's destiny to be here. This is not even a famous spot to stop on the Carretera Austral. We just stop here because we wanted the Wi-Fi. There is a free Wi-Fi here. So I think it's really great. Guys, we will end this video here. We will catch you during the next days exploring the Carretera Austral. We hope that you will come along with us. If you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. Please consider to subscribe to our channel if you haven't done already. Hit the notification bell. Yes. And guys, stay tuned because uh, the Carretera Austral will be fun. We love you, we appreciate you and see you on the next one, guys. Ciao beautiful people. La vita bella. Good evening beautiful people. Today Good evening. <laughs> Good evening beautiful people. Good evening beautiful people.